That's Kurt here, and uh, I want to welcome you to our Friday edition of Day of Devotion as we talk about 1 Corinthians and 1 Corinthians 11, 17 through 19. And I think today's is called, Don't Think That What You Do Is More Approved by God Than Anything Else, Right? The only approval God can have of you is that you have trusted in the atoning sacrifice of Jesus Christ on the cross to forgive your sins, repented of those sins, and were buried with him in baptism. Don't ever think there's classes of Christians. There's not. 1 Corinthians 11, 17 says, but in the following instructions, I cannot praise you, for it sounds as if more harm than good is done when you meet together. First, I hear there's divisions among you when you meet as a church, and to some extent, I believe it. But of course, there must be divisions among you so that you can have God's approval uh, will be recognized. You who have God's approval will be recognized. Your goal, your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to welcome everybody and understand that everything done in the body of Christ holds the same importance from the preaching to the person who cleans up the gum stuck on the bottom of the chairs in the middle school small group. Like the parts of our own bodies, even the ones we aren't very proud of, we all have a place in the body of Christ. Our theme verse has been 1 Corinthians 2, 1 and 2, which says, when I first came to you, dear brothers and sisters, I didn't use lofty words, impressive wisdom to tell you God's secret plan. I decided while I was with you, I'd forget everything except Jesus Christ, the one who was crucified. And I'll just say for me that this is a battle I think we all face. This person's more important. We see this preacher, we see this teacher, and we go, oh, this guy's really important. And they're not. They have a gift from God that they're giving in the same way that, again, the person who cleans up the gum stuck on the back of the middle school group chair is giving. It's just different. In the same way that your face is different than your armpit. Father, thank you for... Uh, the fact that we're all equal in your eyes. And Father, thank you that the only thing that matters is your son and our trust in him. And uh, help us to trust him daily. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Okay, guys, have a great weekend. I'll see you Monday. Um, if you're a praying person, you could pray for me because off I head into scary land right now. And uh, I'll uh, talk to you guys on Monday. See you then.